this is Akshay. Uh, today we are going to explain a venturi effect by making a air venturi pump. Hi guys, I'm Sri Vatsa. I'm going to explain the experimental setup. So we've got a vacuum cleaner here which blows air. It's in reverse action. So the air comes through here and is constricted in this section of pipe. You can see this diameter of this is very less than this pipe. So this is a CPVC pipe setup. We just got a T, a T joint and a elbow and couple of pipes. So and two tumblers. In one tumbler we have water. I have just added some blue dye so that you can see it. Okay. I'm Nitish Bharadwaj, and uh, today we are going to collect venturi air pump. Let's uh, see what happens. Mm. As you can see, the water is being blown from one tumbler to the other tumbler. The theory behind the experiment is the air blower is when the air air blown is switched on, the water the air passes through this pipe, and as you as you can see, there is a constricted region here. The Whenever the air blows and there is a wider region of this pipe, the diameter is more and this depends on the Bernoulli's effect that whenever the velocity of the air increases, the pressure is de uh, decreases at this region of the pipe. Hence, a suction force is created which uh, sucks the fluid dye from this, this vessel to the other vessel. So, we got the exact experimental setup are drawn here. So, this is the two tumblers and it has water at atmospheric pressure. So this is the vacuum cube air blower. So it, it is, uh, this is the constricted region so that the velocity of the air increases here. And whenever the uh, air uh, exits through this region, the air expands and creates a low pressure region here. So this low pressure is less than the atmospheric pressure, pressure so that the water is sucked right in and is transferred through the other tumbler. Uh, this is how the air venturi pump works. We got other illustrated examples of venturi effect. So this is same vacuum cleaner it blows air and I have made a little here in this pipe and we have got some powder here. So now watch what happens. Sucking and spraying all over, uh, spraying the powder all over. I have the air entering at very high speed, so it is flowing through a constricted region here. So at the, as it exits, it creates a, uh, a low pressure region, which in turn sucks the powder from up here and blows it, blows it down this uh, this. Region. This is how the venturi effect works in this setup. Venturi pump is uh, spray painting and uh, I'll show how it works. This is that when the air blows in high velocity, in this region, uh, low pressure is created. This contains the paint. Due to the low pressure region, the paint is stuck through this and it is sprayed onto the paper. So thanks for watching. I, I hope, hope you enjoyed this.